Hi everyone! In today's video, I'm going to share with you the five reasons why I'm making videos about my expat life. Hello, it's so good to be here with you again. The weather is gorgeous, things are going well, and I feel great. So I'm new to this whole video making thing in the world of YouTube, and a lot of thought and preparation goes into making videos, and there is a huge learning curve at the beginning. My main concerns for many months before I actually started making videos wasn't so much about the technicalities behind video making. I knew there would be a huge learning curve, and I was willing to embrace it for the cause. My main concern was whether or not I should be making videos at all. I was worried about fitting into this world of YouTube with all of the other millions of YouTubers who make creative, entertaining and informative videos every single day. I was concerned that although I had a desire to find my voice and be heard, that I would eventually run out of things to say. So one day, during my concerns period, I was having lunch with a very good South African friend of mine, and I was sharing with her my plan to start a YouTube channel. I explained to her around the idea of making a channel and the types of topics I would like to discuss, and I expressed to her that I wasn't sure if I was yet ready or if I would actually ever be ready. She listened to what I was saying and then she responded by saying to me, what's the worst thing that could happen if you just start right now? She then asked me to tell her the reasons why I do want to make these videos, which became a much better focus and conversation for both of us. My reasons for making these videos are exactly what brings me here today and what excites me and pushes me to keep going. So today I'm going to share with you the five reasons why I'm making videos about my expat life. The first reason is to make a record of my life. Life passes so quickly and one day can so easily blur into the next. It's easy to forget what we did yesterday or last week or last month and I don't want to get to the end of my life and forget many things that I've done because we do so much and it can so easily be forgotten. I want these videos to hold my memories so that in 5, 10 or 20 years I can look back and be reminded of how truly wonderful my life is. The second reason is to stay connected with friends and family back home. People who travel and live abroad, like myself, see so many weird and wonderful things every single day. And there is so much going on that might seem totally normal to us, but in fact is totally bizarre and abnormal to our friends and family back home. But they want to see it. They want to know about it. And speaking on Skype or WhatsApp is brilliant and a very good way to stay connected. But videos bring our worlds to life in a way that our friends and family will truly appreciate. It's not always possible for our friends and family to come and visit us, and I hope that these videos that I make will give them the opportunity to understand me better by seeing what my everyday life looks like. And that leads to number three, to connect with other people, other expats around the world, and build a community of like-minded individuals like you. Often as an expat, it's easy to feel quite isolated and lonely when living in a culture that is different to our own. And when you deal with challenges in your life, like we all do, it's very easy to feel like you're completely alone in how you are feeling and that no one around us would understand. But when we have a way of connecting with other people and can be open and honest about how we really feel, that there are many expats around the world feeling exactly the same way. I hope that these videos will open up opportunities for deeper connections around the world. And number four, to have a creative outlet. There is scientific research that says that creativity and being creative can make you happier. And from what I can tell, life is all about figuring out what makes us happy. Video making is creative and a lot of thought goes into thinking about what to talk about, planning the filming, writing the script, setting the stage or the background. It's all creative and I can already tell that making these videos is definitely causing some happiness within me. And the fifth reason today is to have a voice and to share what I care about with other people. There are many things that are important to me, including traveling, cultures, health and well-being, eating good food, my family, being a mother, being a wife, being globally minded. And like any good meal, it is so much more enjoyable when it is shared with someone else. We are social beings and we care deeply about many things. If I kept everything that I care about to myself, life would be nice, but it would be so much more enjoyable if I share what I care about with others. When we meet other people with similar interests to ours, a connection is formed and a friendship develops. It is important to 
step out into the world as ourselves and a video platform is the perfect way to do just that. So for today, my question of the day is this. Have any of you considered embarking on video making, either for your business or personal life? What are your reasons for making or wanting to make videos? Please tell me in the comments below or just take a minute to say hi and introduce yourself. I would love to meet you. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out on all the next videos that are set to come every week. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day.